You know how you really look forward to getting a certain teacher at school, and then you finally get that teacher. And so you start school on the first day, and you walk in, and the teacher isn't there. It's somebody else. It's not who you thought. Well, that's what happened to Noelle and her best friend Todd in third grade detective num detectives number one, The Clue of the Left-Handed Envelope by George E. Stanley. The kids, Noelle and Todd, walk into school thinking they're going to be in Miss Trimble's class, but then they find out from Amber Lee, the know-it-all, that their teacher moved. And now this new guy, Mr. Merlin, he was apparently a spy. But why would a spy teach third grade? They thought that was crazy. Well, it turns out Mr. Merlin really was a spy. And he helps the class uncover so many different types of mysteries. In the third grade detectives number one, this one, he helps them uncover the mystery of who sent Amber Lee a message that she got in the mail. And it just said, Dear Amber Lee, you are the smartest girl in the world. Signed, an admirer. And she didn't know who it was. They didn't sign their name and they didn't put an address on the envelope. So Mr. Merlin, along with Dr. Smiley, a police scientist and the class, work to figure out who it is that sent the letter. And he helps them figure out different clues and even crack secret codes. So if you wanna find out who sent the letter and if Noel and Todd can crack the case before Amberly, then you should read Third Grade Detectives Number One: The Clue of the Left-Handed Envelopes. And if you like this one, you should more read more of the George Stanley books, where he takes this third grade detective class on even more adventures.